Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is Booty Hunter 1971. I uh, just got back from a hunt with my friend MT Wolf 2270. Uh, we hit a little swim area today that we hit probably two weeks ago. Um, it's been really rainy and stuff here most of the summer, so we didn't really expect a whole lot. And then when we got there, there was two guys coming out of there with metal detectors, so we really expected even less. We talked to them for a couple minutes. Uh, they said they had pretty good finds. They said it was kind of slow because they attributed it to the rainy weather and uh, the cool weather. It was actually raining today. Um, MT Wolf and I got a late start because we just got off from work this morning and went straight to the spot. And like I said, when we got there, they were already two guys coming out of there. And we talked to them, and um, you know they, they said they did pretty good, but of course nobody can find it all. But uh, we're using the, the diving shaft on the AP Pro. That I come up with again today and um, MT Wolf actually set his up the same so we thought well we'll give it a try and see what we can find as we can actually see what we're looking at instead of just waiting and, and hoping that we're getting good coverage and it really paid off because as you can see there's some really tiny targets here and I got a silver ring here it's a 925 ring and this camera doesn't have macro, so please forgive the blurriness. Uh, it seems to be a cannabis leaf on this silver ring, but it is stamped 925. And um, I got this really old crucifix out of there. I mean, I'm not sure it's old, but it's been there a really long time. As you can see, all the encrustation on the on the crucifix. So I was happy with that. Got this little tiny heart pendant. It has a cross on it as well. It's hard to see, especially with this camera. Um, got this little Superman pendant. That was pretty cool. And um, I don't think it's marked anything. It's not. So it's, well, it actually does have something written on it. I'm not sure that I can. I, I thought I saw something written on it. I'm not sure. I'll have to look at the loop. My eyes are not what they used to be. And this little bitty, which seems to be a 22 bullet. Um, all these things, and the, the cool thing about this, and all these coins too as well, they're just modern clad, but the thing about it, all these targets were missed. These guys just come out of there, and these targets were missed. You could see the rows, you know, when you drag a scoop, the rows that, that your scoop makes, you could, we could tell exactly where they had been. But we just hunted it methodically, and using this the short diamond shaft and five by eight coil with this AT Pro, we were able to really methodically and meticulously hunt this area that had just been hunted, and it's not had that much activity over the last couple of weeks uh, due to all the weather and the rain. And you can see these little pieces of foil and things like here that usually drive me nuts uh, chasing these because they sound good. They come in in that gold range. You don't want to pass them up, but they're they're hard to find. They fall back through your scoop and all that when you're waiting. But with with this, you just simply fan fan, and you can see exactly what you're dealing with, and it makes it a pleasure to hunt. And it really paid off because this has been missed by not only those two guys today, but MT Wolf and myself a couple of weeks ago. And it, the looks at it, of it, um, let me get it over in the light where you can really see. It looks like it's got so much um, deposits of rust or whatever on it it's been there probably this whole swim season if not longer and uh, so I was really happy with that the, this diving rod has really paid off if you guys would like to set yours up this way all you got to do is go to www.searoversubterfuge.com that's www.searoversubterfuge.com S-U-B-T-E-R-F-U-G-E dot -E com and then click on the tab for purchase product plans and it's in there for five dollars you can get these plans to, to set yours up the same way put the handle on it and uh, you can start finding the things that people that think they're really hunting the place good are leaving behind so till next time this is Booty Hunter 1971 talk to you later